this is Luke from Art Cyclery here with our ninth video log. Uh, I've got some really cool stuff to show you today. Let's start off with the new Speedplay Nanogram Zero pedals. Uh, these things are really, really light, 129 grams for the pedals themselves, uh, 211 grams for the pedals and cleats. They are You'd look at them and you wouldn't think there's a whole lot different from the regular Zero, but let me, let me show you what's going on here. If you look at the spindle, you'll notice there's no wrench flats, uh, so they've decreased the bulk of the spindle itself. The bow tie is aluminum instead of stainless steel. Uh, the hardware holding everything together is titanium, a bolt on the end too. Uh, the pedal body itself is a new carbon reinforced thermoplastic that's lighter. And on the inside, there is a new hybrid ceramic bearing, a regular bearing, and a bushing instead of just two standard bearings and a bushing. So they're lighter, they spin better, uh, and they're a lot more expensive, but hey, nothing's free in this world. The cleat uh, gets lightweight hardware and a, the same thermoplastic uh, carbon reinforced plastic that the body of the pedal does. There's two sets of hardware included that fasten the cleat to your shoe. One set's really light, um, and Speedplay claims that that's a one-time installation only. Easy, if you torque on those too many times, they're gonna get galled up. So they come with the lightweight set of hardware and a standard set of hardware too, so you can take the cleats on and off if you need to. Next, we are really stoked to be carrying the GoPro cameras. Uh, this is the new 1080 HD Hero. We also have the 960 HD in stock as well. If you go to the GoPro website and just take a look at their, their, their demo uh, clip, you'll come right back and buy at least one of these. The clarity is awesome. Uh, the camera itself is really small. You can see lightweight. Um, tucks away real nice and easy on your helmet. We have chest mount, handlebar mount. We've got all the accessories. These things are great, so get one of these, start filling up your YouTube page. Uh, next, another brand new item, the Garmin Edge 800. It's about midway in size between the 500 and the 700 series, but it does so much more than both of those. Touchscreen technology, uh, you can scroll through maps, scroll through information screens, it's highly customizable. Uh, and of course, it comes with access to Garmin's software, so you can download your routes, you can make maps, you can check out other people's routes, you can, when you're traveling to a new, uh, new zone, you can see where the rides are. It's, it's really awesome. The Garmin 800, nice and svelte, really a lot cooler looking than the old 700s, and uh, not too much bigger than the 500 too, so it's still nice and compact. And then finally, we have perhaps the world's first uh, mountain bike specific floor pump. This is the Dirt Floor Drive from Lazine. Oversized barrel. Uh, this is specifically for large volume tires. The gauge, the gauge only goes up to 70 PSI, and you'll most likely never get even close to that. Uh, but we inflated some 2.3s with 12 strokes. Just really quick, uh, we've also seated tubeless tires with this pump without a whole lot of effort. So all the claims that Lazine makes about this pump are true. This thing's great. Uh, this is the CNC version. We also have the Classic and the Steel Drive in stock as well. So highly recommend the, the Lazine Dirt Floor Drive pump. Uh, that's it for this week. So there's a lot of stuff here that we just got in that you're going to want to check out. So go to www.artcyclery.com. If you have any questions, feel free to call us or email us. And I'm Luke. Thanks for watching.